while I make my grand return, let me pick up my controller here. Oh, my cables are all weird and stuff. All right, let's see here. Let's just see here. So I have some uranium to invest, I recall. Let's see here, manage AMs. So I'll keep on giving it to the new one here. Like that. Still a little ways to go before we level you up. Still a smidge to go there. So well, let's just shimmy past my, uh, my scale there. So close to being able to get level 30 scales. Well, one level away. I won't say that, like, I'm close from level 29 to 30 or anything like that, but did I mess up OBS? No, we're fine. I think it's a million. Bates told me everything. Poor kid practically pissed his pants just talking about that black skill thing. Perch Perkins, huh? But don't you worry, I beat some courage into him. It'll be fine. Um. Nah, some concern. Nah, well, ain't that sweet. Sorry, but we play by different rules here on my team. But he can't stand you. Help him up by beating him till they do. In any case, we owe you one. Or more to the point, we owe you this. Cool. Mission complete. Oh, hey, you're on across that black skull too, right? Tell me straight. I don't know if it's this thing that's gunning for us. I don't know. I didn't see what level it was, but I could have attempted janking over with overdrive stuff. Um... <laughs> it's nothing to worry about, it's just Perch Perkins. <laughs> oh, we got a real arrow here. Far cry from that whiny little Bates. Still, if it's specifically targeting Blades, probably worth having Raleigh keep an eye out for it. I'm not too scared myself, but there's no harm in keeping it safe, right? Anyway, you stay safe too. And good luck with your work out there. Wow, thanks. And segment recon complete. Sweet. Sweet, sweet. Okay. Also, oh, my Blade level still isn't up. But. I've technically haven't checked this for like the entire playthrough. I technically haven't. So uh come to the barracks briefing room for the details, same as usual. Yeah, I don't know why this flash is like this. But yeah, let's uh accept it. Whoa, I don't know why the screen flash is here, forgive that. Show the materials required for repairing skills and heavy machinery. Please bring us moranium. Okay. Um seek I seek warriors who will come tire hunting with me. Release yourself to this. Katsu! Okay, I may as well uh, accept all the things. Now, hiring weapon prototype testers reports to the outfitter's test hangar the moment your eyes recover from all the flashing. Could really use some help here. Whoops, dang it. I didn't mean to decline that. Um, demand for Mirage Scopes has gone through the roof, especially with everyone's vision not working after seeing this. We just don't have enough in stock. Help us replenish your supplies. I don't know if I can look at this much longer. We are investigating possible new energy types, but there's some... I can't look at it here. I'm just accepting them all. Screw it. Yeah, because I recall having uh, way more quests back in the day. Is the thing. I was so confused why I didn't have so many quests. Is because I haven't uh, really done much of anything around here. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Oh, I did one of them already. Sweet. Love my music and require a number of Lee Lilies to help make a new type of instrument. Oh, and I'm due to play live soon. So if you could maybe hurry, I got blade wear. Go to the Lee Lilies and deliver them to the blade member. Cool. Another one. And it gets the screen to go absolutely crazy. Um, just initially, though. Uh, a certain someone has started breaking plates now. Please bring us some sea and enemy platters to use until production is ramped up. Gather the sea and enemy platters and deliver them to the cafe employee. So I had two that were uh, there. I got this one. Jeez. I. Sure. Jeez. Jeez. Ow. Ah. My goodness gracious, we want to give our loyal blades in the field something nice to eat for breakfast. If you come across any AGR melons, we'd love to have them. Grab the AGR melons and deliver them to the culination. Okay, I probably shouldn't accept too many here so that, you know, I can actually accept others that are out in the world and stuff. It's maybe not a bad idea. Ah, so it lists, like, the blue ones separately. Ah, so I probably can accept all the, uh, all the normal missions here. Yeah, different from basic missions. Yeah, okay. Let's see here. Deliver 1,800 units of Moranium to the male mechanic in New LA's administrative district. Okay. Where's that at? Wait, no, I can't do that right now. I just donated all my Moranium. Whatever. <laughs> Whoops. Hold on. So, uh, when it comes to, like, my normal missions here. Um, yeah, I can't do that right now. Sure, was this the one of the uh, other the other Nuppon that I'm escorting here? Maybe I can get rid of him being in my party already. 
real quickly. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that real quick. Let's go ahead and get rid of our other travel companion that's been with us for a good while here. Maybe what we can do. So, my skill. How do I get there? Around this way? <laughs> okay, you better not be mean. You better not be. Okay, whoa, that is a bit of a ledge. Are you not gonna... Oh, you are gonna attack me. It's just gonna be a cutscene because part of the quest is what you are. Okay. Hmm, oh, money grubber back again. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Mumon would never abandon best and most handsome customers. Boss wants shipment inside. Hmm, who is that? Bah, what is Earth Alien doing here? Bold move, Earth Alien. Are you so eager to die? Wait, 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 a friend is mistaken. This is business associates of Moomin. Uh, less associates and more assistant. Really just lackey, to be honest. So much heavy lifting is hard on knees. So Moomin find poor and desperate looking peasants to hire. Moomin friend is no match for mighty prone and far too cowardly to start trouble. So my prone friends will let him slide just this once. Hmm? Lackey. <laughs> Still seems like more than Earth Alien deserves. But he does look pathetic, weak, flabby arms. Not worth my time. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Are you sure about that? I no promises once Earth Alien Pet is inside. Friend is most benevolent. Human will take full responsibility for the actions of this uh, pet. So then, friends want the shipment inside today? Human eager to get this over. First, satisfy customers, so in we go. Yeah, I probably should have done this forever ago. Oh, I can just uh, just drive in, I guess. So there are some baddies over there that will probably be trying to kill me as I drive in. Does that totally make sense? But uh, in we go. Squeezy! Squeezy! In I go! Wee! Okay, I'm here. <laughs> okay. Um. Phew, this should be far enough. Prone at door only said inside, so this must count. Being surrounded like this is a bit scary, but shipment not going to deliver itself. Delivery complete. Next stop, home. Stop. Client not approved goods yet. You are poor merchant. No, what? Yeah, sorry, friend. Moomin did not see any boss types around, so it's just heading back to entrance to get someone. I am boss, and I check goods. You wait. Bah, trick. It's this trick. Eh, is something wrong, friend? I am not friend. You are cheat. I order three times usual amount. Where is rest? What? We would never hear anything about increased order size. Silence. You are bad, merchant. Now my men go hungry. Hungry prone are poor workers. This mistake will cost me fortune. You will fix this little cheat. Gah, well then. How about Moomin taking this shipment back, verify order, and return with... You make this up right now, or I make a difference with no on flesh. Ah, 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 ah. Ahem, um, Moomin think now is time for you to shine, friend. Protect Moomin, but do so in business-appropriate, non-trade relationship hurting, peaceful sort of way. Negotiate. Make all okay. That's why Moomin brought friend here in the first place. Now it's time for friend to earn money that Moomin never technically agreed to pay. I'm um, offered to track down the remaining items. Resolve the situation with force. Ah, uh, fine. I'll do right by Moomin here. By uh, keeping him in good relations, I guess. Friend is serious. That's 14 more keywags according to ridiculous demands of prone. Keywags are a huge pain to in rump together. And Moomin not going to pay extra for all that work. Friend really think we should do it anyway. Granted, that may be the only way for Moomin to get out of here without becoming lunch. Alright, Moomin and friend will go find Keywigs. Hopefully I have them already. Nope, I have zero. This is going to be one of those quests that I just don't get to for like 3,000 years, isn't it? 
Because, like, I guess I could have fought them, but then Moomin would have been mad and he wouldn't have his trade deals anymore. I mean, it's not like Moomin's exactly being all that nice to me, so... <laughs> would it really have been that big of a deal? So, I mean, I've explored basically everywhere in Oblivia at this point. Why don't I have any Keywigs? Like, where would I find those? I've been across this whole place at this point. Maybe it's in one of these areas I've, like, barely touched or something? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not doing it right now. Uh, though, speaking about items, let me check the Collectopedia, because I haven't actually checked it in a good while. Hmm. Yeah, so it's gonna still be a little while before, uh, before I have more stuff complete there. Here's a thing complete for, uh, Noctilum. I can show the full items there. There we go, some more battle points. Stuff. Yeah, oh, I got all the relics in Noctilum, that's cool. That's nice. Lucky panel. Row complete. More battle points. Cool. Go ahead and do that. And then this here. Yeah, still a decent few items to go around the world, it seems like. Still quite a decent few to go. Lucky panel. Wow. It's so lucky. Okay. Okay. Oop. Lucky panel. Wow. Okie doke. Ah, so I can complete fauna here as well. I still like the jet turtle. Fleeting baboon. More battle points. More battle points for me to hoard. Shove those in the collectopedia. Natural artifacts. Ah, I have all the wreckage, so that's cool. So that's neato. Row complete. Sweet. All right. Um, I have a decent few things in Curios here now since the last time I checked. But yeah, still, uh, still a whole lot of different types of collectibles to go. Chameleon sand. Uh, still seems like I've barely scratched the surface of Silvalum here. I have all the natural artifacts at least. So at least I have those. I go row complete. Neat. Um, almost all the wreckage, not quite all of it. Not quite all of it, though. Hmm. Put that in there. Almost all the Xenotech and almost all the Curios, but missing one of each. Darn. Thunderbolt Emblem. It's like the Fire Emblem, but a different element. There we go. Then I probably have like a smidge in Cauldros. Like, Cauldros is easily the one that I've explored around the least. Since it is the final area of the game, but... Okay. Just keep on shoving things into the, uh... Into the Collectopedia here. The Collectopedia is actually pretty satisfying to, uh... Be filling up and such. Oop. Okay. I feel like it was more satisfying in Xenoblade Chronicles 1, just because there was, like, so many different areas. Like, less items per area, but more different areas. Whereas this one is just five areas, but, like, a bazillion items. That's still pretty satisfying to fill up. Still pretty satisfying to fill up, I do have to say. Um, in terms of some other stuff in the world, remember how I was mentioning how there was like a cave system in Noctilum that I know you can go around to like grind for monies and stuff. During one of the cutscenes earlier, I did wind up googling where exactly to find that. And apparently, where is that, uh... This, I believe. Yeah, over there somewhere. I did wind up Googling it, and I don't know exactly where it is. I might have to look back on my phone to double check. But apparently, it is off of a... Oh, I can fast travel right up here. That's nice. I think it's attached to one of the thing where Bob's around here. Is what I think it is. Like, it might actually be that system over there. My skull is on the ground there. Oh, that sucks. So I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to do this just by running is unfortunately the case. Yeah, because when I was looking up during cutscenes, it started started here and then went around here somewhere, I believe. So, it's the kind of thing where it's not super duper important to get, like, right at this moment, per se, but I would at least like to establish its location and get, like, a fast travel thing where Bob there, because just in case I decide to do any grinding off camera, it would probably just be for, like, credits, just the in-game currency thing where Bob, 
and before post game i think that that's like one of if not the best place to do it there is better ways to do it like after post game i think or not after post game like after uh, after the main game and into post game i'm fairly certain but during the main game i think that it's a bit over here that is the best place for it i'm fairly certain at least from what i remember back in the day I remember doing it a whole bunch back in the day, and it served me pretty well back then. It was what allowed me to grind the funds that I needed to uh, upgrade my skills for the final boss. So, uh, is it this? Is it deep in here? And is this the cave system that reaches to, like, the other side of the mountains into that one probe? Ah, so I have a fast travel point there. Nice. Is it through here? The cave that I'm thinking of. Oh, you guys are alive. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Oh, no. No. Well, at least I should respawn with my skull now, right? At least I should. Yeah, this entire time that I've been looking for, like, a cave with a bunch of materials and a cave for, uh, you know, reaching the other side and reaching that final data probe. This entire time, I think it might have been this. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Okay. Let's go through here. Do they not come alive if I'm in my skull? Well, if I run over them, they do. This is it. It is indeed. Yeah, so there's that guy there who, uh... Oh, yeah, so this probe wasn't on the other side. It's just over here. So, apparently he'll attack me if he sees me. But, uh... I'm fairly certain when I was, like, grinding this forever ago that I, uh, that I was at a level where he wouldn't attack me if he saw me. Same with, like, the other enemies around here, so maybe this isn't a good place to grind right now. But essentially, all these bazillion collectibles, you just collect these for, like, a really long time. Because the cap of whatever item that you can have in your inventory in this game is 99. So if you pass 99, then it just immediately gets sold on the spot. So it's a really good, quick way to grind credits. Okay, maybe he would always attack if he saw me, but I just, like, never got close enough for it because he, uh, really needs you to be, like, super close for that, I guess. What's this up here? What's this up here, huh? Is it something that I can currently harvest? Maybe, maybe? I can. Nice. Sweet. Who knows what that is? We're gonna find out after 3,000 years of, uh, you know, getting these other collectibles. Yeah, so these other guys, I'm not currently at a level where I can grind here without these other guys fighting me. But maybe that's not too big of a deal? Maybe? Yeah, so this is just like the place for a bazillion collectibles, essentially, is what this is. Yeah. So this is what I essentially did to get uh, get the high-level skills to beat the to beat the game back in the day, I remember. This was the place. This was the place to do that at. The go-to grinding spot. So hey, if I feel like doing any grinding off camera, I guess this'll be this'll be the place to do so. So yeah, as long as I don't get too close to Mr. Dudo there. Hey, the bumps are a bit weird here. And then I'm fairly certain if you just do this, I think all this stuff comes back. I think. You need to give this like a lot of run-throughs before you reach 99 and they all start getting sold off immediately. Yeah, they all just respawn like that. So um yeah, this is one of the fastest ways to earn credits in the game. And also get blade level. Like, I'm getting one point for each of these right now. If I switch my, uh... If I switch my division to prospectors, I believe I'd be getting more. So you can do this to, like, max out your blade level as well, which... Honestly, I might not mind doing. Because all that really means is I get, like, you know, my other field skills earlier. I get to harvest stuff earlier and it saves me a little bit of time, you know? So that might not actually be a bad idea. So if I spend any time in Xenoblade Chronicles X off camera, it's probably going to be doing this. I don't want to do a whole lot of this while streaming is streaming. I just wanted to showcase that this is a thing here. <laughs> this is all I really wanted to do. Because, yeah, I remember doing this while watching YouTube for so long just to get a whole bunch of funds. So, yeah, they're not being sold off right now. Because we got to get to 99 of them first, and then they'll start being sold off. But, yeah, there's that. So... Whoops. There's something new in the residential district. I hear things coming out of the ground. So I'm just gonna avoid that for now. Yeah. So I now have all the probes except for like the 
whole set up here that, uh, you know, I'm gonna need Skell Flight to get up there. Yeah, okay. Okay, pretty solid there. Let me check my missions real quick. I'm probably gonna wrap up the stream here pretty soon, but I wanna see if there's anything else that I can, uh, do here real quick. Do I wanna do this really quickly right now? 14. Mm. I don't know. Sona Herbs. Um... In Noctilum's Rust Lake. Where's Rust Lake? If it's up there, I can't get up there right now, I don't think. I don't have any of the things. Oh, it's over there. So that should be pretty simple then, right? Maybe this one will be closer? Sure, I can do this one mission. This one I can do, mayhap. This one works. No. Oh. No. Yeah, I mean, you. Could, I could probably take on. Are you still ticked at me? Screw it. This won't hit anybody else, right? Cool, yeah, there's no other enemies close enough. Yeah, I'm just gonna delete you really quickly. <laughs> this is what I'm gonna do. Just gonna really quickly delete out as the whole world bugs the heck out. Oh my goodness, you are close, aren't you? You are very, very close indeed, huh? Okay, well, yeah, we just kind of delete you. Kaboom! Time to stabby stab. Time to stabby stab. I was worried that somebody else got in the got in the mix there for a second. It's like I didn't have to worry about that. Okay, so I'm looking for uh, six phosphorus tree seeds somewhere within this area. Oh, no wonder I didn't have any. They're key items is a thing, so just for this quest. So I gotta go around finding all six of them. And there's probably only six, that's a little bit irksome. Can I take on you at this point? Oh, not if there's a couple of them. Not if there's a couple of them. Ah! Oh, there's another one there. Okay, I have to take out you for a quest? Okay, I guess that's uh, I guess that's what I'm doing. I guess I'm taking you out for a quest if it's necessary. Okay. Boop. Ah, the screen is going. Ah, I'm so sorry, by the way. I have no idea how to fix it. Stuff that I'll look into a smidge off camera, but like, no guarantees if it can be fixed. No guarantees there. Okay. Pew 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 pew. I haven't been dropping frames for a while, right? Yeah, it seems like. Okay, well, phew. There. Oh, that was uh, one of those basic ones like, jeez. I accepted. Blade level up. Ah! Okay. But yeah, I might potentially just, you know, just freaking do the division switch to prospectors to uh, jank over that one thing where Bob's. So this is probably one of the basic missions I accepted as well, right? Probably. Probably laser. Where are my friends at? Are they not battling as well? Oh, they're over there. They're catching up. I'm a little bit fast in my skull here. Just a little bit fast. Ow. You're mean. So dang mean. Pew pew. Many pews. Cool. Okay, so there's another thing Bob over there. Um, no idea what quest that was for there. Just gonna explore around like this a little bit. My camera out like that. I thought I saw a red one over. Oh, here it is. There we go. There we go. So there's this one here, and then where was that last one that I saw? Because I could have sworn I saw the last one, but it was like surrounded. There it is. So as long as these guys don't see me as I jump right on top of it. Yoink! Here we go. Talk to Sullivan at the integrated production plant in the industrial district. Cool. Nice. That wasn't too bad. Oh, and there's something new in the residential district. That's a new thing in the residential district. It's a new mission, Water Woes, huh? Okay. Okay. Okay, I got the, uh, I got your six samples thing, Bob. I got them all. I've collected them all for you. I collected all six of your infinity stones. Welcome back. Judging by your demeanor, I anticipate good news. Um, here you go. Yes, precisely the specimen I desired. 
Uh, of course, I say desired only in the sense that it is vital to my research. Not that I... Right then. I'm impressed you actually brought samples for storage, research display, training, sponsor kickback, and birthday purposes. You are a wonder, sir, and a champion for Mir and Botany. Though your actions may not make it into my research paper, know that the results of your work shall live on for all time. If nothing else, please look upon your contributions with great pride. Oh, and you'll be pleased to know that I finished analysis on the samples of the first specimen you brought me earlier. It's shocking, really. The plant changes on a cellular level between morning and night to become a wholly different organism. It goes beyond any conventional definition of the word plant. It's, well, it's an entity, I suppose. Just another in the long list of assumption-shattering finds on Mira. I well realized gathering those samples was not easy. You have my sincerest thanks, kind sir. If I require hard to obtain samples again in the future, I hope you'll lend me your services once more. For storage, test display, training, sponsor, gift, award, propaganda, and or personal use. <laughs> one can never have one one can never have too many samples, right? Remember, this is all about science. Alright, there we go. Another mission complete. Cool. Got limited NVD, whatever the heck that is. Whatever that be. Oh, I should go have a chat with the uh, Eleanor about my blade level. So, if you want to change your division, do you just do that in the menu, I wonder? Because, yeah, prospectors, if I'm if I'm doing stuff with that, with that one cave, it might be a good idea to uh, switch to prospectors at some point. Blade levels, Risen Harmonia, congratulations. Your newest bonus is right here. Wall decals added. Okay, now I can change it to some other things. Cool. We change in the customization center. It's a set of wall decals. Right now, you're limited to decorating your barracks with the eight division decals, but you're about to get a lot more options. When you get back home, try it out and see. Now, on to your bonus field what skill. Uh, yeah, sure. Biological field skill has gone up a level. That concludes the awarding of bonuses. Please come report to me when your blade level rises again. You know where to find me. So now it takes a uh, 15k. Yeah, I still have the other up on traveling companion. I'm gonna have to get those uh, 14 thing more bobs. I don't have any moranium to redeem right now. Um, what was I about to check? Oh, I was about to check how you uh. Oh, there's the return to. I forgot there was a return to scale button. I forgot that was a thing that existed. Quite frankly. Okay, how do you change division? On missions. Here. Let's see here. Not an affinity chart, I would imagine. Intel. Social. Nope. I don't know there's some way you do it. You probably do it in like the barracks or something. I would imagine. I would imagine it's somewhere in the barracks or something. Is there any mission that I can really quickly ham out here? Um... Hold on. 27, 27, 27. Okay. Um, let's see here. Here's the barracks. Deliver. Oh, yeah. I need to deliver the uranium there. Um, no. I don't have those. I have one of those. Oh. Oh. The lost stuff in Primordia. If you have the runaway dog from the area of Primordia's Bono River. I can do that one quickly. This is what I can do. 3D printers. Okay. Sure. I'm gonna retrieve a doggy and then I'll wrap up the stream shortly after. This is my plan. That is my plan here. All right, so I hope I can just go to there from here, right? I hope. Maybe? Let's see. Let's see here. Oh no, there's no way I can. Because it's gotta be like up there. Hmm, darn it. So I'm probably gonna have to go like somewhere from here, I imagine. Probably gonna have to go from here to make it there, right? Most likely. So let's roll on over. Squeezy! All right, so they're not small enough for me to trample. They are a bit bigger than that. I'll just glide through the water super easily here. No problemo. What's this? Is it something that I can harvest? Nice. Yeah, just mechanical level one. Get a few credits from that. Okay, so... Labrador. 
don't know how you made it up here, but uh, hi. There we go. So my rewards for that are a Labrador. So I can have my own Labrador now? Is what you're telling me? We currently have a cat in the barracks. If we could have a, uh, a doggy instead, that'd be pretty cool. Oh yeah, I should check out the new customizability stuff is what I should do. There's a thing that I should do here. Let's see here. So barracks customization, um, pets. Yeah, I can change to Labrador now. Changed, okay. Um, wall decals, so we have new stuff here. So those are the stuff from before. Sakuraba Industries, Granada Galactic Group, Meredith and Co. Candid Incredible. Right, so it's just the, uh, it's just the arms manufacturers right now. Hmm, I don't know. Sure, they have a cool logo. I'll do theirs, I guess. <laughs> just like promote their thing where Bob and my barracks. Okay, let me get a refresher on, uh, on this mission here. So yeah, restricted members there, survey cl complete close, close comrades affinity mission. So that'll probably be a thing for next time. Which one was it again? Fathers and sons, BFFs. We can do a bunch of affinity missions next time. We were soldiers, a day in the life. Yeah, I should be uh, I should be doing a bunch of those. Wait, did I already do the uh, one in question? The uh, close comrades? Was that the one that I did this stream? No, I did a, I did a different one this stream. I did the uh, one with Lynn. One's close. This one's close comrades, right? That one's close comrades. Okay. We can do that next time. We can do that one next time. We're getting there. We're getting there. Bit by bit here. One step at a time. Bit by bit. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. My very good progress this session. It went on a bit longer than I expected, but that's kind of what happens with Xenoblade Chronicles X. It pulls you in and then it never lets go. So, uh, so that happens. We're gonna wrap up the stream in a stream here is the plan. We're gonna go get some rest and until next time, take care all and see ya.